Today we have an interesting one for you. This game is called Outside. It's pretty darn new in my opinion, but uh, there's no videos on it yet, so I was like, why don't I become the first one to do it? Because it looks so interesting. Uh, it's pretty simple sounding how you play. It literally says just survive. So I'm like, I can do that. I, I can definitely do that. So we're gonna give this a run through. Uh, like and subscribe if you want to see more of these videos. I'll be trying to do if this game ends up being good, I'll do more of them. I mean, I can already attempt. I can already guess this game will be fun. Okay, we're running. That's good to know. Evil Games presents a guy running. Gotcha. I'm running from something. I just don't know what it is yet. What am I running from? Ooh, a house. Ooh, a light. Ooh, a door and a window. What are those graphics, bro? Am I safe? Oh, there's some guy walking at me. Outside. So does this mean you just can't go inside buildings and stuff? You should find the name of the, ma the maniac in the single mode. The name serves as a key in freedom. We'll solve several names and then... At each name, the unique history. In the case of failure, you can begin a new game. Anu. Good luck. Thank you. Ooh, these are, this game has pretty graphics. Can I make this more visible for you guys? I think this is super hard to see right now. Video. Can we turn the brightness just a hair? Uh, one second. I want to make it so, like, you guys can actually see. Or is this really how it's going to look all day? Okay. I, I don't care then. Close. Okay. Alright. Oh, sorry. Dang it. That's really weird. Can I pick you up? Like, can I pick up a candle? Or is it literally just going to be dark? Purpose. Find out the name of the maniac. Alright. So how do I do this? I really want to make this brighter. It's so dark. Interlacing shadow. Man, they make they, they, it's so dark. Okay, so we're just gonna act like that didn't hurt. Oh my goodness. Game, be brighter. <laughs> Hold up. Um, voice, effect, ambient, interface, video, resolution, resolution, view, distance, scale, density, <laughs> epic, uh, what if I turn on the shadows of here? This feels so dark right now, I can barely see. All right, so it's super dark in there. Oh wait, what the? That door just opened. Okay, so that's the house I walked into. So let's go run for a little. So first thing I can already say about the game is the graphics are really good in my opinion. Like they look nice. I haven't seen them in daytime or if it even becomes daytime, but is that you? No. I don't know what you... So supposedly there's a maniac in the game. I don't know what that means, but we're probably going to find out pretty quick. Okay. Just going to walk around. It runs really smoothly. So, if you have your graphics all the way up and you have a decent computer, not bad at all, I won't lie. Um... Definitely just heard something in the background. Hi, Mr. Deer. Hi. Come here. I'm coming for you. Uh. Oh, is the deer like a thingy, like, follow it to find out where stuff is? I don't know if it's like a, uh... <laughs> Do we have a map? We don't? Okay. Okay. 
Okay, so really quick thing I know, but I already figured out about this game. When you open the like pause menu, you can't just click escape to leave it. You have to re you have to click close instead. You can't just leave it there. Seems pretty chill at the beginning. I mean, that room was so dark I couldn't see with the with the junk. Ooh, what did I find? All right, let's go down here. See what this is. And so really quickly, this game we before like I load it. Oh, pretty lights. You know, this game definitely has like nice graphics. I can't. I like them. All right. Um. So are you just like little glowing things? Gotcha. No sign of a maniac trying to kill me yet. So I mean, that's. I'd assume that's a good sign. <laughs> Usually they let you kind of warm up before they just throw a thing at you. Um, like, what do you do? So far, so good. Uh, let's go this way. See where this takes us. Eh, hey, stop being slow. This guy needs to learn how to get some cardio and run. <laughs> Over here, all right. Eh. All right, so you can't just climb up like rock faces, I guess. Okay. Okay, so the game has like borders. I got you. So you can't just like run into the middle of nowhere. You have to like follow certain pathways. I guess that the game makes for you. Can you just kind of run anywhere? Oh, okay. Oh, there's a border. Oh my goodness. Eh. So yeah, you guys is stamina, that's for sure. So you can only run for so long before he like gasses out, I guess. Do I not have like a flashlight or anything? Let's try I. No inventory? Okay. So they, really, they literally just throw you into it and you're pretty much forced to learn the, okay. Uh, do they have control settings? Options? Uh, save settings. No? Okay, that's fine, I guess. I guess that's cool. <laughs> eh. This person's so slow, it hurts. Uh, let's go this way a little bit. I feel like the cabin we had to stay in. I feel like I totally, <laughs> I feel like I completely screwed up and completely missed the beginning of what actually had to happen. It's just that room is so dark. I couldn't see Jack in there. That just might be me being horrible at life, though, which seems like it's a pretty easy thing to have happen, especially knowing me. So let's go back to that house, see what was over there. When... So I wonder if you're playing as a girl character, because whenever she jumps, she makes that like sound. Here's another trail. Oh my gosh, stop making that sound, lady. Na, 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 na. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's head back to that cabin. I think I think I totally missed a checkpoint. I, I totally think I missed a checkpoint, people. I'm sorry. <laughs> ah! Run, lady. Or, man, I don't even know who you are yet. Oh. So, I guess a good way to know this game is going to be probably good, because it's in early access, so there's still a lot to be done to it. But right at the bat, I can already tell you, since it's made by Unreal, it's gonna, the graphics are great for that reason. You know, the graphics look awesome. Um... Unreal typically does pretty good games, so I, I assume this will pick up pretty fast as a game. Like I think I think it'll be accepted by the community really well. Once the updates are fully in, I think I think it'll get more and more popular as it grows. I think as of right now, obviously, yeah, it's not gonna be huge because it's not like fully developed. Alright, let's head back to the house, because I guess I missed something. Urgh. What is that sound? 
It's snowing out there really badly. Yeah, if anyone lives in Michigan, drive safe out there. It is horrible out here. I live out in, like, the parts where those snowstorms are really supposed to take effect. Alright, let's see. Let's see. Alright, good, good to know. I really have nowhere to run. Okay. Ah! Oh my gosh. Beat up a little. Oh, wait, hold up. Wait, what? You can just, like, grab stuff? Wow, I am a failure. Okay. Okay. I officially really suck. So there's something on there that doesn't look too... That doesn't look good. Let's try going up here first. Let's see where this takes us. Ah! God. Oh, okay. Did I even go up? No, I didn't. Great. 